Welcome back to my channel. It's Venus Baby Lexi Rane Art. All of the above. This video is going to be about my braces. I'm at the orthodontist right now. I just got out of my appointment. And yeah, you guys, as you can see, I got my wires tightened today. I wanted to talk about why I have braces again because this is my second time. I had braces when I was like 13 or 14 years old and I had a thumb sucking problem. I had to stop sucking my thumb in order to get my braces and I was willing and able to do that because I wanted straight teeth. So I went through this very painful process of having this device installed in my mouth, having spaces put in between my teeth. Um, this bar would stop my thumb from being able to be sucked, but it cut into my tongue and it made eating very difficult. And I had to wear that for months. And it was super, super uncomfortable, but it did the trick and it got me to stop sucking my thumb. So I had my daughter, and when she turned one, I started getting triggered to suck my thumb. Like I just had urges to suck my thumb like crazy. Breastfeeding my daughter triggered me to want to suck my thumb. It was like the comfort thing. It was like really triggering me. I was disappointed because it had been years since I had braces and I noticed my teeth were shifting already just naturally because I didn't have a top retainer. I had lost it years ago and I recently found it. And I did, I never got a new one because it was gonna be like $200 at the time and I was like, it's not even worth it. Like my teeth are fine and I don't need it. So years later, I wish I had that top retainer. It would have saved me a lot of, I don't know. <laughs> but long story short, I decided to get braces again and I decided to stop sucking my thumb and I did so willfully and I just I used my mental strength to stop sucking my thumb before like I said I had to have this device put in my mouth and it was super super painful but this time around I was like there's absolutely no way I'm going to go through that again I just I just want the braces like I don't want to go through that process I'm going to try to stop sucking my thumb on my own because I did go, I managed to go years without sucking my thumb and fighting the urges and being able to, to overcome it. So I thought to myself, it's possible that I can stop sucking my thumb without any help. But I ended up fighting the urges off and willfully stopping this age old habit of mine so that I could get these things. And they said that I don't need bottom braces I wanted bottom braces I still do like but I have a retainer for my bottom teeth I lost my top retainer but I never lost my bottom retainer I never lost any of my bottom retainers I have like three of them and I still have all three of them so I just have to wear that with my braces if they don't put braces down there because they might if they don't I'm gonna be kind of upset because this feels very uncomfortable like I just feel like my bottom teeth are just they need braces <laughs> but then they say I don't need it but I'm, I'm like uh, this is what I want only I only need braces for a few months so it's either my next appointment which is in six weeks which is in November it's like my bottom teeth aren't bad at all like I know that they are generally straight I just I notice where they've shifted I don't want to wear my retainer because if I wear my retainer I'm going to be tempted to take it out so I can eat so I can sleep I'm going to take that shit out especially if it fucking hurts and it fucking hurts with these it fucking hurts still my problem is you give me a retainer I take that out when it's when I want to eat when it's uncomfortable and then it just it leaves too much room for me to forget about it to not put it back in and to not want to put it back in just put the braces up there I came in here wanting braces on top and bottom and I'm walking out of here with just the top I'm gonna have to do something about it and I'm still here and I might go in there it's not bad at all. I know, I know I'm being very particular and I hate, this one thing I hate is like being talked out of what 
I want. I don't know if I should go in there right now. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm going in there. 